Austrian University offers multiple overseas PhD projects for international applicants, which involve a wide range of cutting-edge research topics. For example, in our School of Computing, we have a research topic of artificial intelligence, as well as a bioinformatic research, which I'm currently engaged in. For PhD studies at Ulster University, there are a variety of funding options, include the jointly funding from industry or institute, as well as vice-chancellor research scholarships. An advantage that cannot be ignored is that those opportunities for cooperation is not only within the university, but also cooperate with companies or institute, which broaden our future career paths or allow those employed by certain industry to transfer from one career path to another. I'm involved in a full-time PhD project jointly funded by Ulster University and Scotland Rural College. The funding covers my tuition fee necessary live expenses including rent, daily transit, meals, and so on. Projects also come with certain budget for research purpose, include uh, the purchase of devices and uh, registration and travel expense for academic conference and the cost of publication and so on. The full financial support allow us to focus on our own research and self-improvement. Above the daily life of a PhD student, the first is to complete your personal research work. For in my case, it's mainly about the data analysis or experiments based on specific research plans, summarize the results and present them in well-written documents. In addition to that, you have flexible options to improve yourself to achieve the research goals. Um, we really spend a lot of time on studying literature and based on your own need, you can choose to participate in course or workshops conducted by faculty or doctor college on a regular or irregular basis. Of course, you are not work alone. There are a lot of communication and cooperation in daily work. It is including discussion with supervisors, meeting with other research team members, as well as presentation at a conference. In this part, you can present your idea, research plan, result to others in different ways. And you can receive feedback from outsider to enhance and improve yourself. As milestones of PhD program, there are three important assignments. The first is the initial assignment, which is after you, three months after you study your PhD study. And the second is the confirmation assignment, which is around the end of your first year. And the third final assignment is uh, come, with, come after you submit the dissertation. Austria University has a very well operating support system to help us reach our objective throughout the whole PhD study. By the doctor college, faculty and department of university, there will be workshops and trainings held on a regular basis, give guidance on PhD students. For example, including how to conduct a PhD research as well as general skill training and guidance on career development. I have weekly and bi-weekly meetings with my supervisor to discuss my recent research progress and what needs to be done next. And uh, when I encounter any difficulties, they will give me timely feedback and support. They help me on the professional questions as experts on their own field and they support me on collaborating and self-improvement as uh, experienced researchers as well. Researcher development program included diverse topics and covered as much as possible of all our needs in PhD study. In addition to professional skill development, RDP organized different forms to help researchers have more communication, such as dinners or hiking activities. RDP has periodical reminders to ensure that we will not miss any events. 
Because of the sufficient and frequent activities, we don't need to worry about time conflicts missing one of them. That reduces quite a lot stress on time management. During my PhD program for the past three years, I have participated in several academic conferences and research segments. Due to that, I travel to different countries and regions, and I work with people from different fields, which are awesome experience. I gave oral presentation at the PhD festival in my first year, and prepared submitted three minute thesis video in my third year. Clearly presenting my own research to different type of audience in a limited time not only improve my own understanding of my research but also sharpen my ability to express myself. After the university PGT training, I'm engaged in several modules demonstration work that's helped me accumulate the experience in teaching and also helped me to uh, improved my professional skills. As a great honor, I have been awarded the Faculty Best Literature Review Award and the Student Travel Award of an International Conference, which are huge motivation and encouragement for me. And thanks to the university online recruit recruitment activities, I have opportunities to speak with HRs from different organizations, learn about the conference each company that I might join in the future and get the information of the positions they provided. PhD study is essential if you want to pursue academic research in the future, but definitely more than that. With the practice of skill accumulation and knowledge, I have deeper understanding of the world and myself from different perspectives give me a lot of motivation to experience things that I don't have chance or initiative to try in other situations, such as public speaking. It forced me to wait between student and work, provide me sufficient freedom to study and improve myself as well as think and read. Most important is allow me to put my inspiration into action.